Hello and welcome back, this is Double O Debbie, and this is episode 122 of Ocean Block Let's Play. And boy, I'm really excited. Uh, this is uh, mycelial network is coming along quite nicely, and I have plans that I think that will work, and I wanted to share it and see how it goes. So let's go look. Um, I got the flux dust automated. So I can now craft all the flux points that I need, which is good because I plan on using them. <laughs> so let me show you what I got. Uh, right now this is off because we have some blue lights in here and I placed interfaces down and I'm hoping uh, that this will work but I want to test it like on one to begin with uh, to make sure it works like intended. I figured I could put uh, power pots on each one of these um, and have it each individual one activate the ingredients that it needs. Um, except for like wither skeleton skulls. Um, <laughs> that's a different system that's uh, gonna be on top of this already uh, so maybe this was a bad one what about you what are you okay we can do that let's just plop this guy over here okay and switch you to the reactor awesome okay now we want to get a power pot uh, now I would also want one for the dragon essence for this too, but for now I want to set up the, the air essence one. Um, so, farmland, oh yeah, we got an insane farmland. Um, and do we have, yes, we have an extra seed. Sweet. Um, there we go. Now, this is set up to only work with the redstone signal. So eventually this light will go off um, and it won't produce a redstone signal anymore and this will fill up. And this should eventually shut, shut this off. It's what I'm hoping. <laughs> But this is going to take a while, but it's good to see that um, the interface is working. I may need to get some upgrades for these two. Um, might not need all those, but we'll see. Is that three or eight? Three. Processing. It's process. Oh, oh, we're out of power. Ah, I've got old power systems under there. But look, I don't get it. I've got plenty of power over here. Is this um what network is this? Where 
is the, is the ender cake. Do we sit like down here or somewhere? Uh, maybe this is it? What are you on? I may need to just replace all of that uh, energy cable with some better ones, but I can't. Ah, I think it's up there. No, it's not. Ah, there it is. What do you want? No, oh, it's on the right one. It's only outputting 5,000 a tick. Mm, probably because it's hardened. Um, do I have, I have an indicate blazing? or anything. Okay, blazing. I automated the blazing indicate, so let's take this guy off. Okay, now it's transporting 18,000 a tick. That will hopefully be enough. I need to put all this stuff back. <laughs> Just ripping stuff up. Uh, oops. Oopsie. Okay. Um, get all the stuff back down real quick. Ah! Okay, hopefully. Yeah, you got juice now. Let's help it along. <laughs> okay, it's been saving up some stuff. Yeah. Oh, why is it doing all this chorus fruit? Um, I'm not sure. we get enough air essence if that light will shut off uh, what's it set at 5,000 um, well I'm happy to see that it works with the light on uh, that it is transferring the signal up so that's good and uh, I can go ahead and make more power pods 
and get some more of these set up. Um, like this one for the Wither Skull. Now that's good. We can monitor that. Um, but I don't need the interface there. Uh, because that, uh, the Wither Skulls are generated on their own. We may need to, I don't know what else to do to, let's go check on the wither skeleton skulls. Um, it's in here. It should, it should be going. Okay, we've got, we've got the detector back here. That's emitting a signal if it's under 12,000. So it should be activating it. Why aren't you go? Oh, it's out of essence. Um, okay. Uh, we got an essence tank right here. Um, what if we just Oh, I don't think that system is hooked up anymore. Um, the the tank, I mean. I don't think I, I think I put it in. Let's go out to the mob farm and see what I did with it. Yeah, it's on a tank now hooked into the network. So I should just be able to, um, Put an exporter, exporter over there. Um, let's do that. Get an exporter. I just made an ex one earlier because I needed an importer, and I made an exporter and went. Oops! I don't need that. So. We want to export uh, fluids, oh, essence. Um, oh, essence. Yeah, that's the one we want. And then if we just hook this in, should start working uh, except we've got to tell it that we want it from the front pole is that the wrong type of fluid It's not taking it in. Um. Oh, dude, I think I just 
just broke that. Error, top add-ons and just going. Okay, now it's not an error. Now it's an error. Huh. Okay, but it's still... Um, let's try to get a tank, maybe? So we can see what's going on. Um, uh, get rid of you. And I need to get that automated. it output the back and then input from the right and then oh the hopper is picking it up I was like what okay uh so let's get the exporter back and oh dude. Oh, this is changing the efficiency. I don't want to do that. I want to connect this and tell it to export all oh, essence. This is only okay. now it should work. <laughs> there we go. Um, now we should be able to go in and see. Uh oh. See, it's starting to fill up. Okay, so we might not need this cell after all. start killing more skulls. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, we have that turned back on and that should make always keep at least uh, 12,000. That should be good. Uh, so what is next? Uh, this is like what I'm going to be working on. I'm going to go through each one of these and make sure everything's automated. Oh look, it turned off. Sweet. So it is going to work. Nice. <laughs> uh, it filled all the way up and it turned off. It's no longer um, running. So that is 
good. That means I can start filling up some of these other ones. Like the lava, I won't need one either. Uh, I might need to... Um, I might need to increase production of lava. I don't know. Let's go look. We have a black hole tank that's been filling up for quite some time. Where are you? Over here. 401,000 buckets. That's buckets, not millibuckets. Um, 78, 77, 78. Uh, so some of it is being used, but I think we're a net positive. While that's not working, though, it didn't appear to be we're burning through the lava very fast. So our lava production may be okay. Um, we may, may need to like add another line to this, um, but I don't think. Um, I don't know if the cobble gin can handle more than that. Uh, so we might have to add another cobble gin and another row if we need to. Uh, but it's like 11 buckets. 11 buckets every 8 seconds. Uh, so I think I think I'll let it go this uh, this way and see how it uh, goes after after the system is up and running on its own. So yeah, uh, let's get uh, let's get like another power pot going. Another power pot going. Go ahead and make this. Awesome, and I hope <laughs> I'm gonna leave this for a minute and hopefully everything will work out great and uh, stuff. Uh, Nether Star is another one that we don't need to automate. Um, actually, we do have a Nether Star seed. Since we're using the skulls, to uh, produce power over here, we may not want to um, also use them in the making of uh, the nether stars. Uh, so we might go ahead and put a power pot with nether star seeds. Um, I want the Insanium farmland. Uh, let's go ahead and, because I want to make sure all of these have the best farmland that they can. And I think the Nether Star one might use it anyway. We might need it. Um, so let's teach it some farmland. Insanium farmland. Yes. And I believe the system knows how to make insanium. Oh, it does not know how to make insanium. Oh, that's right, because I have it in a different system. <sighs> um, I was trying to think.
Okay. Wanna use. Wanna you. Wanna you. Okay. work I just I don't want it to automatically update everything or upgrade everything but I do want to be able to automatically make insanium at the same time <laughs> so let's try it again awesome okay um, got the farmland Oh, I'm so excited about all this. This is going to be great. Having a super duper... Um, oh, well, let's check our power pot. It's not ready. <sighs> okay. <laughs> um, I thought I fixed that uh, issue I was having. So I thought it might make it all by itself. Oh, it's still going. Okay, so it is going. And it's making, it's making the Mark IV. Okay, it just <laughs> takes it a while. I need to get these upgraded um, badly. So this will be a little bit quicker. Oh, I had the power cables on me. Um, I had the power cables. Oh, and the points. So I could do that. Uh, do that. I can get that done. Because this is, this is unacceptable. <laughs> it's taking so long. I don't know if I need to disable the limit or anything. Almost done, bro. No. I wonder if I could <laughs> disconnect these uh, and not mess it up. will make all our future power pots a lot easier to craft. Dude, you stop. Um, didn't I pick up? Okay, there it is. I 
accidentally broke something. So we'll get you, you guys upgraded. Still wanting to figure out a bigger storage, especially oh no, <laughs> especially if our mycelial network starts running full time. Um, we'll definitely need uh, more power storage. Okay, get you back. This will be the last side. Should make our crafting a little bit better. Um, put you up and put you up. Okay, let's get back over there. And a boop. Our power pot is done. Yay! <laughs> Um, let's go ahead and start another one and see how long it takes that one to go through. Um, I do want another point here. Um, with the bottom band and and star seeds. Yes. go okay uh, so that should basically just fill up the internal buffer um, I could probably increase this number to like 5,000 like the other ones takes two different essence so I don't necessarily need it to be hooked up to this part so I can probably add another detector like over in this corner I guess um, one to detect the I think it was uh, dragon essence oh my goodness it's so dark I can't see anything dragon egg seed no dragon egg is it dragon egg essence This isn't hooked up to the network. 
I was like, why didn't it come on? <laughs> it's not working. Um, here we go. There. Now it's working. Uh, so we can put a power pot on top of there, which... Is it done now? It is! That was so much faster! Nice! Okay, so... Um, let's get a farmland. I mean, I figure if you're going to put it in a power pot, it should have insanium farmland. Um, right? Am I right? Dragon egg seeds. And go ahead and put you back in there. And another pot. take some of the stuff out of this thing. I don't use all of it anymore. Alright, and we need to get you... Oh, no! They stole my stuff. <laughs> Not a speed. Okay. Three of you. Awesome. So that should start producing. And since it's hooked up right here, it should also not activate our system until all the lights are turned off. So that's cool. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to try and hook up all the rest of these. <laughs> and get this thing going so it can finally turn on and run. Um, I think the only thing I should have problems with maybe is the disenchantment one. Um, because of the books, um, it takes a lot of essence to make the books. Um, I wonder, yeah, I'll try to figure that system out, uh, how we can hopefully get that part automated too, because that's going to be, I think, one of the biggest hangups is keeping our books, um, flowing in. Uh, we got plenty right now, but it's like not that many. <laughs> they do burn for a long time, but it's not that many. Oh look, we've gone down uh, in books. Nice. Uh, so yeah, this is what I'm going to spend the next little bit on. It's finishing up this whole system, adding more power pots to it uh, so that we can regulate more of the items coming in. Anyway, uh, <laughs> let me know your thoughts. I'd love to hear from you. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.